this visit by the Lord, it's, it's a very old tradition as I understand it. Uh, it has certainly uh, been here since the Economics Prize was initiated in 1969, but I th think that has, it is much older. It probably goes back to the early days of the Nobel Prize. So uh, it's a very nice old tradition that we are happy to um, continue. They have worked out a model of um, how markets function if there are frictions in the market. And frictions here mean that there are difficulties for sellers and buyers to get in touch and difficulties for firms to find workers and vice versa, for example. And that means that you can explain many things, perhaps especially in the labor market. Why is there unemployment as well as vacancies at the same time? The theory is relatively easy and intuitively easy to understand and also the model is not too difficult to use and you can within this framework study different interesting questions like for example if you change the level of unemployment benefits and the replacement ratios etc. Traditionally, we have had a great emphasis on labor economics in Uppsala, and uh, the search and matching theory is an integral part of the first year course in macroeconomics. And uh, what I like about this theory is that it's flexible, it's accessible, which is very important, and most of all, it's, um, it has a great way of explaining why unemployment is um, ultimately inevitable, even in equilibrium. In my research, I look at both the search frictions and the labor demand and I look at the relative importance of these factors for explaining unemployment. If I didn't have access to this theory I'd probably not be doing this research at all and uh, of course if you look at it that way this research has, has had great importance because it has opened a whole new field of studying how the labor market works. Uppsala is uh, the oldest Swedish university and uh, in terms of social sciences uh, and economics we are very strong in, in certain areas. Uh, Uppsala is very strong in labor economics and also public economics. The visit is certainly important in the sense that it means that we um, connect to the research frontier outside Uppsala and it's good to have this connection with the um, top researchers so typically this can also have some spin-offs effects in the future perhaps. <laughs>